what's up, gentlemen? So we've talked before about the importance of being perceived as a high-value man. The whole concept and reason is that if you are perceived as having high value, you are more desirable, you're more attractive, you are going to get more opportunities in life. And I'll assume that because you are a subscriber of the FM YouTube channel and our goal here is to help develop high-value men, your value through the roof. If you agree, gentlemen, drop me one of these to be like, yo, high-value gentlemen right here. But today we're talking about those spicy Sandy Rita's because I am sick and tired of all these women thinking that they are like super high value just because they're pretty. Being pretty, super sassy, having nice boobs and a super sweet booty, gentlemen, does not make somebody high value. It makes them hot. But today I'm going over six signs a woman is low value. First, sign that a woman is low value is she's got low self-esteem. It's all about self-respect and if you don't respect yourself, how can you ever expect anybody else to respect you? The other unfortunate reality is that when you are dating somebody with low self-esteem, oftentimes this will manifest itself in some really unamazing ways. More specifically, you getting cheated on. A person with low self-esteem is constantly seeking reassurance or validation. And oftentimes when you get into a relationship at first, you're enough, right? They're like, oh my God, you're incredible. But then the newness, the novelty wears off and you're not kissing their ass every single day. And so what do they do? Exactly, they go look for somebody else to kiss their ass. Low value women are constantly seeking attention, approval, likes, posting pictures of their booty. Gentlemen, I'm not saying that their booty isn't amazing. It doesn't deserve to be shown, but the fact is, if you have self-respect, chances are you're not doing that. The second sign that she is a low value spicy senorita gentleman is that she is self Center. He doesn't worry about other people. She's not interested in anything else going on in the world. She is only worried about herself. She's only worried about how other things affect her. Gentlemen, if you are dating a self-centered individual, you are in for a really uncomfortable ride. She doesn't have the capacity to actually think about you, to really consider you, your feelings. She's only worried about how things affect her. If something bad happens, how does it affect her? If something great happens, how does it affect her? Another telltale sign that somebody is self-centered is that they are rude or have bad manners. Whether or not they're rude to servers, to wait staff, to customer service reps, their mother, their father, or they've got bad manners. They don't say please, they don't say thank you, they expect that you're going to wait on them, you're going to do for them because they are the center of the universe. Of course. Third sign that somebody is low value, gentlemen, is that they have bad habits. They don't take care of themselves. They're not striving for self-improvement. So we talk all the time on this channel about the importance of developing better habits, right? Whether or not that's your diet, your workout, your grooming, your style, your relationship, your career. The fact is, it is critical for each and every one of us every single day to do the things we need to do, even if they're small, little, tiny things, in order to be better tomorrow. These better, healthier habits are going to make us stronger mentally, physically, emotionally. But if you're somebody that doesn't pay attention, doesn't worry about it, and is constantly neglecting themselves, there's zero chance that you are going to be successful at this thing we call life, gentlemen, and we've only got one shot at this. There's a book that I recently listened to from today's video sponsor, Audible, that I am begging you to check out. It's called Atomic Habits, an easy and proven way to build good habits and break bad ones by James Clear. It's all about making small, little, tiny changes and having a strategy as opposed to having a goal, right? And this is the thing that totally rocked my world. I was always the dude that's like, oh, I need a goal. I need a North Star. But what happens when you get there? Focus on the goal as opposed to the strategy or system in order to get there. And that is what James helps you develop in this book. Guys, it is ridiculous. And when I mean ridiculous, it will change your life. And if you are somebody that wants to be better, you want to achieve more guys, you have got to hit that link down below. And right now for a limited time, if you go through our link audible.com slash alpha M or text the word alpha M to 500, 500, you can get a free 30 day audible trial. But right now they're doing a ridiculous deal. Limited time though, it is for audible premium plus. $9.95 for the first six months. So let me go over a few reasons why Audible has like been such a huge game changer for me. So I am not somebody that is gonna sit there like and just like read a book. I don't have time, I'm a busy dude, but I love listening to incredible things like podcasts, not to mention like memoirs, motivational books, guys, and Audible is the leading provider of spoken word entertainment. It's all in one place. And so for me, I can listen when I'm on the go, when I'm out for a jog. I can listen to some incredible audiobook. Recently, like I said, I've been rocking a 
atomic habits as I'm developing new habits. But the other beautiful thing, guys, is that you can listen on different devices, whether or not you're in the car, you're at work, you're at home, you're on the go. You can listen literally anytime, anywhere. It is amazing. And the way that Audible works is pretty genius. Each month, when you're a member, you get one credit to pick from their premium section, which is the premium titles, right? New releases, celebrity memoirs, all like the super hot stuff. And those titles are yours to keep. You keep them forever in your Audible library, but you also get access to the entire Plus category. The Audible Plus category is filled with thousands of audiobooks, not to mention like guided fitness programs, meditation. They've even got like sleep trackers, not to mention like a ton of podcasts. And the other cool thing that I love is that they've got free versions of some of your favorite shows. You download them, you stream them, there are no credits needed. You get as much and as many as you want. If you hit that link down below, audible.com slash alpha m, or you can text the word alpha m to 500 500 in order to grab the limited time special offer, which is amazing because this offer is less than regular membership. It's $9.95 a month for the first six months. Not only do you get to select one title from the premium category, and I would recommend grabbing Atomic Habits today. Do not wait, start today. But you also get to download and stream thousands of all you can listen to audiobooks, podcasts, all for, like I said, less than regular membership. Guys, it's a huge no-brainer. Start today, audible.com slash alpha m or text the word alpha m to 500 500 today. The fourth sign that she's low value, gentlemen, is that looks are really the only thing she's got going for her. Honestly, like be honest, like be honest. Like other than the fact that she's super hot, like what else? Unfortunately, a lot of times these women also are going to fall into some really bad, unattractive things and habits like having fillers and injections jammed into their face. It makes me so incredibly sad when I see all of these women these days, like going out, getting veneers, getting like lip injections, getting all sorts of like extent, like they are trying so incredibly hard to be beautiful and perfect when the truth is they were beautiful and perfect before and now they're just going down this dark rabbit hole. Once you start injecting and jamming Botox and fillers and, and lashes. These women end up looking like all swollen and puffy and once they start doing it, it's really hard to stop. And I see a lot of these women that I'm just like, oh my God, you have totally effed up your looks. Number five is she doesn't have a plan. No plan. Like, what are your plans? What do you want to do? What do you want to accomplish? And the answer isn't marry somebody rich or just be hot on Instagram. Guys, you got to be with somebody and find somebody that is driven, that is motivated, that is career minded. There's nothing sexier, more attractive or more high value in my opinion than a woman that is goal oriented, driven and motivated. Not to mention smart. She thinks about things. Now I'm not talking that she has to be like a rocket scientist, scientist, scientist or anything like that, but she can't be a dummy. And last but certainly not least, the sixth sign that somebody is a low value Spicy Senorita is that she is lazy. I'm not talking about liking to sleep in on Saturdays or anything like that. I'm talking about she is lazy, as in she doesn't want to work. She doesn't want to actually go out and get a job. She lets other people take care of her because she's pretty. You want to drive a nice car? Do it. You want to carry a Louis Vuitton bag? You want to have like nice designer clothes? Fine. No problem. Be as materialistic as you want as long as you are the one that is working for the money and making it happen. But if you are just relying on the fact that you're super hot and dudes will give you stuff because dudes are stupid and only think with their junk, I assume that you are smarter than that. And that's that's why I want to do this video because I see a lot of, a lot, like when I mean a lot, I mean, oh my God, so many beautiful women that are beautiful, definitely sassy and spicy, but they got nothing going for them other than the fact that they are hot. Are they hot? Yes. Are they high value? No. They're low value. Yeah, they're spicy, but gentlemen, spicy senoritas are a dime a dozen proven by Instagram and YouTube and all these places that spicy senoritas are like, yo, look at me, look at my boobs, look at me dance on TikTok. Gentlemen, here's the deal. You are high value, gentlemen, so why the hell would you mess around with somebody that is not worth your time, that is low value? You deserve better because you're amazing, you're also incredible, and you're getting better, more valuable each and every freaking day.